purposeful tool a flat tire. Purpose driving is one full of nurses to be given to the people of Tasmania the parcels tour. I'm glad the rush is not on today, thought Pat. But this day wasn't going to be a good one. As you can see why, he was driving along the coast when he heard something that went pop. Hello? Something went pop. He stopped and got out to see what went pop. It was his tire. It went flat. Oh dear. I'll never get through the mail now. There's only one thing, a candle. I'll have to walk it. Ted came up. Hello, Pat. What's the problem? My van's got a fat tire. Mm, it's no good. I can't mend it. It will have to be replaced with another tire. I'll tell you what. You can take the other van out with Royal Crown E.R. Mail. God, I dare. That might help. The collection's coming in handy. Aha, uh -huh. there she is. Oh, look. At this. Another van. The same as the other one. With Royal Crown, E.R. Mail. How very thoughtful. His collection is. He went on his way. He had a letter to be given to some people who went walking. It was important and they have to sign for it. He went to find the caravan park. He came to the caravan park. Hello? Anyone at home? That's annoying. They must be out for the walk. I'll leave the nurses on the table. They'll be safe. But what about this registered letter? Oh. I can't leave it in here. It looks very important. I'll have to sign for it. Oh, they left a note. Hmm. They went to the cave. I might find them there. So he did. He went among the bush rocks, finding the cave so it called Hastings Cave. He could see them coming out to give He could see them coming out. He got out to give them the letter. Then went back with the delivery work. He came back to the post office for more mail when he saw his first man already waiting for him. The other mail was in it. Oh. 
a real magnificent niece. What just was told me, he had been sleeping in the van all the time again. <laughs> I sort of know he's sleep waiting. Or I suppose I'll get working with my van. Postman Pat Australia. <laughs>